Hi there, welcome to Merton near Appleby. I'm here today to show you this um, lovely five bedroom barn conversion that sits directly behind me. The property um, takes a little bit of explaining because it's deceptively spacious, which you'll see when we go inside. It is a converted barn that um, is set over three floors and offers a huge amount of living accommodation. It's very flexible, it could um, be used for holiday let potential, it could be for multi-generational with an annex, or it could just be a really spacious family home set in this beautiful village at the foot of the Pennines. Externally, it has a driveway and a garage and to the rear, it's got a, an enclosed garden. So let me show you around. Property that we're here to see with the brown garage door and the brown um, wooden front door. I'm just going to show you the street scene first of all. So you can see we've got a couple of properties at either side of the of the barn conversion that we're bringing to the market. And as I pan around, you'll be able to see the street scene. So you can see the beautiful Pennine Fells there in the distance. And then. We just set off a, a lovely village lane so nicely situated away from the road so you're in a really quiet and private location and as we walk up the drive i'll just explain a little bit about the property so we're attached to the left to a, um, a another property which is an old farmhouse and then we've got these buildings to the right of us Hawthorne Edge owns the driveway, however we do need um, to keep, keep the area clear to a certain extent due to this property just here with the white windows. Um, we, they do have access across the driveway to park their vehicle. So as I said in my, in my opening paragraph, the um, property is really deceptive. So behind the wooden front door there, we've got a large amount of living space. We've got five bedrooms, a family kitchen, we've got a couple of bathrooms, and it really is um, a TARDIS inside, really. So just to explain a little bit more, we've obviously got a brown garage door here. These steps and this paved parking area, they belong to next door. Um, so the steps up to the brown front door there, that is access into the next door's property. But all the windows that you can see in front of me here are included with Hawthorne Edge. So I'm just going to take you in the front door and I'll show you around inside. Okay, so this is just us coming through the wooden door into an entrance hallway so you can see here you've got a tiled floor and a space for coats, wellies, shoes and this staircase in front of us leads up to the main living space. First of all I'm just going to take you to the right though so this is part of the property that's got some potential. So behind here we've got a large lounge which has got a wood burning stove and this part of the property could really be used for, for anything. It could be annex potential, it could be Airbnb, holiday let. It really is quite flexible. It's got a really spacious lounge. You've got a doorway to the left there that leads into the garage and a storage cupboard ahead of you there. And then going along here, we've got a large double room. And there's also a ensuite shower and bathroom in here so this room could or this ground floor could be great for multi-generational living if somebody wants to be on the ground floor for access or it could really be for a large family or whatever you want really so if we go back out of here into the hallway and then go up the stairs you'll see what i mean so the property from the outside looks relatively small so going to take you up the landing you've got stairs here leading up to the second floor and this door here leads into this great living space so the room is really big it's got windows on both sides you've got a wood burning stove there and then you've got this fabulous space to the left here so like a garden room really down a couple of steps <laughs> And then you've got a tiled floor. So this is really, really quite special. I'm just gonna see if I can show you the views out of the window here. So look at that view, absolutely stunning. It's worth noting that this property owns um, the land which is directly 
behind the property up to the wall but there is a public footpath um, on the grass part here so a public footpath goes through between the house and the wall used just by locals on their daily walk and if I just pan around here you'll see the fabulous stonework so it was a barn that was converted about 21 years ago into this really fabulous family home so from here just let you enjoy the views out the front and you can see the parking area there and then I'm going to take you into the kitchen so it's a traditional farmhouse style kitchen really spacious room for a dining table in the middle you've got a oil fired ray burn in the corner there and you've got just got loads of room you've got space for a dishwasher and space for an oven so while we're here i'm just going to take you to show you the outside space so through this park glazed door this takes us into the rear rear garden so you've got a wall bordering the whole of the garden you've got this lovely patio area and if you just have a look at that so that's the view as you come out of your back door it's quite special and then you can see here this is your patio you've got further pen iron fells right in front of you behind the houses and then countryside views also you've got a nice amount of lawn and some raised beds out here so this garden is really private and it's very hidden from the front aspect so when we looked from the driveway this year when we first came in the property he didn't actually know that this garden was with, with it so going back through we've still got quite a lot more to show you so we'll go back through the kitchen through the lounge there's the garden room and if you look at these lovely wooden doors there's wooden doors throughout the property and then across the hallway this is the master bedroom suite so really good size double you've got a fitted wardrobe in the corner there and a window overlook in the front but you've also got this great space which is a ensuite shower and toilet area And then again, views out to the rear. So then going up from the ground, sorry, from the first floor up onto the second floor. So going up some more steps here. So you probably already gathered this property's got quite a lot of stairs. Um, maybe not the right choice for somebody with mobility issues, but it does offer a huge amount of space. You've got a storage cupboard above the stairs there. And then you've got three bedrooms on the second floor. So the first one is this one here, which um, is currently used as a study, a double room. And then this is the fourth bedroom. You can see the light streaming in there. Again, a double room. And as we go back onto the landing, you've got a small amount of storage and you can see how wide and bright and open this landing area is and this is the final bedroom so this is a grain great again a great size you've got some ceiling lights you've got a really large bed and a sofa in here and as i spin around you can just see the size of this room so you've got some really good room sizes and then last but not least we've got a family bathroom so that's here on the second floor behind those wooden doors here you've got a large water tank and then this is a bathroom so you've got a white bath large double shower hand basin toilet and then you've got these glass blocks which are bringing the light in so they're obscure so you can't see them but the light streams in from the garden room and lounge in here but there's also a ceiling light so this property is very substantial. It um, has five bedrooms. It has two living rooms or even three if you count the garden room as a living room. It's coming to the market for 350,000. So if you would um, like a pre-market viewing or if you have any questions about this property, please do give me a call on 01768 
881111.